used to be a, a enjoyment to be taking my kids here, but they're gone now, and uh, I just have carried on. It's a tradition, and I enjoy the chuck wagon. That's why I come. We like the fair a lot. We like the fair a lot. Well, it's you get a lot of the atmosphere. You get different people from different communities coming out and taking part in it. As far as Macklin, Saskatchewan, Unity, whatever, and down south, concert, this whole surrounding area. It's excitement and it, it draws people to the community. It's good, the environment's great. Uh, I've never been to a rodeo myself, uh, but it seems if I'm here longer than a year, I'll definitely come back next year, so it's good. It's awesome out here. <laughs> Uh, everybody in yellow is actually all security, and all of us are from the CFB Wainwright, so we're all military members. It feels great. It puts a great image on us and as well the military. It's really fun. Like You get to see all your friends, go on some fun rides and stuff. Everybody gets to come together, experience something where it's not a heavy metal concert or something. It brings everybody down to the level. Thank you so much. <laughs> and the best part about the carnival? The food. Uh, the slushies for me and the ice cream. Yeah, me too. Uh, cherry cola. Blueberry, but I was told I wasn't allowed to eat blue stuff in public afterwards. Yeah. Apparently that's Your a rule. Your lips are rule. blue. We just eat it popcorn. The best ride is probably the drop of doom. And you're not scared at all? No. What is your favorite part of the San Pedro so far? So far the truck wagon races, because those things fly very, very fast, and uh, I definitely wouldn't want to go in front of it. Would you ever want to drive one? I would. I was, uh... Just trying to talk to some people into letting me ride a horse, so we'll see how that goes this week. You've never been on a horse before? Never. Now how do no. you think it's going to go? It might fall down once or twice, but besides that, I should get a hang of it. I don't know, everything seems to be clicking my way right now. This track in Wainwright's short, uh, all it is a barreling uh, contest more or less, and uh, I've been pretty lucky over the years, I've uh, been barreling fairly hard and running hard. I think uh, it's... It's kind of put Wainwright on the map. You know, they're, I think they're the third largest in Alberta for rodeos and stuff like that. So, it's great. Harry, I think we got some Yahooers down here. Two of my daughters, um, Annika's the oldest, she's nine, and I brought Hannah, she's six, and our other daughter Paige is actually on the Canadian Tiger float today, and she's eight. Do you like the freezies? Yeah, and, freezies. And the candy? Yeah. I think it's it's huge. It showcases our community, what we have to offer, and I think it's just a lot of fun, and it's it's good for the community. For sure. After the break, we'll find out what Alice is and how it's changing things in the county of Vermilion River.